In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add a rainbow color gradient to text in Canva. Now, I don't have Canva Pro, I just have the Canva free version. So I'm going to show you how you can do it on that. But if you have Canva Pro, then this will be 10 times easier. So what I'm first going to do is go to create a design, custom size, I'll do 1920 by 1080. We'll go ahead and then click create new design and we'll create a blank Canva document here. So what I'm going to do now is go ahead and go to text and then we need to go to heading and now you can type out your text. So I'm just going to type out here knowledge base. Okay, so now I've done that, I'm just going to highlight it all and we'll make this font size a bit bigger. So we'll go 64 or 88, that's fine. Okay, so once you've got the font size to the size you want, also you would want to change the font, so I'll just change it to this one here. Okay, so now we've got our font size. Now what we need to do is get our gradient so we can overlay that onto the text. Now you may notice that when you go ahead and click on the text and then go to the text color, you can only change your text color to a specific color and you can't add a gradient. So this method is gonna show you how you can get around this. Now, if you've got Canva Pro, you wanna go ahead and go to elements and type in here on the search elements for rainbow. Now, once you've done that, you then might be able to find a rainbow image. So type in rainbow background and then you should then see a rainbow background you can use. Now, any of these rainbow textured looking backgrounds you can use and you can essentially overlay these onto your text. Now, if you don't have Canva Pro like me, what we can do is we can just go to Google and just search for rainbow texture. And then what I'm gonna do is download this rainbow texture from Google. So I'm gonna right click, save image as. And one thing to note here, you wanna make sure that it is a JPEG file or a PNG file, so you can then import it to Canva. So now I've got this downloaded into my downloads. Now what I can do is I can open up my downloads folder. So let's go to downloads. Here you can see we've got the rainbow texture, which we can then drag into Canva. Now, once you've dragged that onto Canva, you need to then drag it onto your project. So we'll drag that on here. So now we've got that onto the project, make sure that when it's on your project, it's on the background and your text is on top. So now double click on your text and change the text color to white. So now you've done that, click on your text again, go to the three dots in the top right hand corner, go to transparency and then Bring this transparency all the way down to 50. So after you've done that, you now need to go ahead and go to share and download this image. So download it as a PNG file, keep all of the dimensions and settings the same. And once you've got that downloaded, you can go ahead and drag that into Canva. So just go ahead and drag that new PNG image into Canva. And what you can do, you can delete all of the other elements which are on your screen. So now drag in this PNG and it's gonna be like a PNG image where you've got your background and the text on screen, which we can resize here if we need to. And now we've done that, we need to just remove the background of this image. So click on it, go to edit photo. And if you've got Canva Pro, you wanna use background remover. If not, just go to Google and just type in BG remover. And I like to use this one here, remove.bg, but there are different ones that you can use. With remove.bg, you can essentially upload an image and so upload the image that you saved from Canva previously, which is obviously gonna be this image, right? That's then gonna remove the background, there you go, and you can see how you've got this rainbow effect starting to come together. Now I would download it in HD, but I think you need to just create an account for that. So for the video, I'll just download it in these dimensions here. So once you've got this new file, you then wanna go back to Canva and then drag on this new file from your downloads. And there is one more thing you wanna do, so here you can see the text effect is starting to take place, but we're gonna delete this file and I'm just gonna drag on the text. So here you've got the text here. Okay, so now everything's looking good. The one last thing you wanna do is go to edit photo, go adjust, and because it's a bit faded, you might want to like go to vibrance and increase the vibrance a little bit. Maybe the saturation needs going up too. And you can mess around with like the sharpness, the clarity and things like that. So basically edit these settings to your liking, but that's essentially how you can get a rainbow gradient on your text in Canva, even if you've not got Canva Pro. So I hope that helped you out. Leave a like and comment down below if it did.